Hey Tubers, so it's about 7.30 in the morning. Um, I come out here a little while ago only to find that the inverter had turned off. So the inverter being turned off, and I replaced the batteries in these two days ago, the batteries didn't work. So there's no stored data. So I came out here last night at about 1am, 1 1.30, 2 o'clock or something. I think it's on my Facebook post what time it was. And it was 6.4 kilowatt hours. And it was still at 25 volts. Uh, if you have a look in the description below, I'll put a link to the PDF that was exported from the laptop from midnight till 4.30 in the morning when the batteries went flat. Now, by flat, I mean they were 20 volts. For some unknown reason, the inverter didn't cut off at the, at the 22 volts that it should have, um, and went down to 20 volts. Not too concerned, all these batteries are second-hand used, and I can probably bet a lot of them were well underneath three volts when I started anyway. Probably more like one or two volts. So, now I'm gonna go and grab a multimeter, and I haven't turned it back on yet. Uh, I think the battery voltage has jumped back up to about 24 volts just because under sag and all that. So I will grab a multimeter and do all the voltages of each cell. Okay, so just 10 short minutes later, I found where I put my bloody multimeter. Um, so again, I'm fairly sure you're not gonna be able to see this, but I'll see what I can do about giving you a shot of it. Right, let's see if that works. No. There we go. Three point three, three point six, three point four. 3.4, and 3.6, 3.5, 3.4. Bearing in mind this pack has never been run, so I've never tested it. I've never, I, I haven't balanced it. I haven't done anything. All I did was charge it. So 3.3, so those are a bit low or a lot low. So I'll probably replace that for end pack. Never mind. Okay, so it's the bottom pack. Now this is the better pack, and so this one should be higher. Well, Three, that's bad. That's the pack that was um, getting warmer last test. 3.6. 3.6. Okay. So, and let me zoom back out again. That cell was three volts. So that cell is going to get replaced out with a new one. I've got a couple more spares up there. So the next test will be with another, a better cell there. So, uh, <laughs> and there goes my multimeter. Uh, it's on its head. Oh well. Uh, it looks like I've got a problem with that cell and one or two of these cells down here. But this cell I'm not concerned about because it hasn't been tested. So that's just starting. That one there, number three, we'll replace it. And see what we come up with. I might even strip it down and see what the go is. Maybe retest every single cell. That'd be a good test. Recapacity test every single cell. Another thing I'm going to do is because I've got to recharge the batteries and recharging that many batteries is going to take a little bit of time if I had to do it through solar. So I'm going to hook up the 30 amp um, charge to it. Plug this into mains so it's not going to lose power. 
and I'm gonna charge the batteries until they're full. Let's see how much energy it took to charge them. Probably an interesting test, I reckon. And certainly one I can do without having to sit here and manage it all day. Now, other, other little updates. My wife has started her own um, Patreon account and uh, PayPal, PayPal and Patreon. Why has my wife started PayPal and Patreon? That's an interesting question. Well, I get all these people asking me, why don't I do this and why don't I do that? And it's basically because my wife won't let me spend the money. Now, my plan is if you give my wife money, I can spend more of my money on this. It's a really good idea. What do you reckon, YouTube? Okay, one more thing, guys. <clears throat> if you like my own videos, can you please let me know what you like? Let me know what you don't like. Um, like, hate, it's all good. It also helps. I make 0 0.0001 of a cent extra from YouTube. And if you could maybe share on social media, that would also be awesome. Cheers, guys. Thanks for now, and I'll see you in the next one.